welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy to have you here. Before we go on to the video, I want to thank you guys so, so much for 500 subscribers. We are so close to 600 and really close to my goal of 1,000. That's enough talking. Let's just get on into the video. So the first slime, I made a batch of slime. It's pretty simple to do. And then I went on with the snow add-ins. So really to make slime, you have to add in your glue, activate, stir that all, knead, and then voila, you have your slime. So first of all, I have my Olive Garden cup. I just decided to use this as a test subject. And can I just say I missed this cup already. So first of all, here's the snow I got. This was from Amazon. And can I just say this was not fine. It was absolutely horrible. That was me, but not really. That's me struggling. And can I just say I couldn't read this. So it was a total struggle. I had a glass of water on hand just for that. I added in some of my snow and I really didn't use any measurements. I went in with some of my water, just enough so that it would expand. Really, it didn't expand as much as I expected it to. Instead, it expanded about halfway through and became really jelly-like and really wet. It didn't come to a consistency that I was expecting, but I still decided to move on forward with it. So this was time to sacrifice my poor white glue slime. All I did was that I mixed in some of that snow. At first, really the texture didn't do anything. The snow just sat in there, like little crystals inside of it. But after a while, you could start noticing it turning into a different texture. You could still see it. It was really odd and wet and warm for some reason. So I decided to just try to fix that by adding in some dry snow to see if that would balance out the wetness because maybe it was overactivated. so I went on and did that. That didn't help at all, it just had clumps of like dry and wet. I tried to make it fall but really it was just a fail. I tried using in some glue to see if that would balance it out but it just got clumpy and sticky and was a total fail. I decided not to fail on this and I went in just with some dry snow instead of activating it. So here's my hashtag vibrant yellow slime. I already missed this. So all I did was I went in until it reached this texture. I wanted to see how it would be after a while. So all I did was that I left it in an airtight container to see it after a little bit to see if it changes in texture. Three weeks later. So this is about a month later. To be honest, I kind of forgot about this slime. Really, it just got even more wet and disgusting. Before, it wasn't as wet as I would have expected it, but now it was leaving a ton of residue and you could see the snow was just falling everywhere. Really, I don't recommend this because the snow really messed the slime up. It didn't fluff or drizzle like I was expecting it to. Really, it was just wet and disgusting and had no good ASMR. It got really messy and I just don't recommend this. But in the end, if you want to make clown slimes, just definitely invest more money into it. It was about $13 for Snow Wonder, while this one was $6. In the end, I'm just saying I don't recommend this snow for making cloud slime. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. Definitely leave in the comments down below what I could have done better. If you're new on my channel, definitely hit that subscribe button and click the click for more to see some more videos of mine. I love you guys so, so much, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!